Hello Thunderbird fans, once again you are on YouTube watching T-Bird TV with myself, Cooper Hopkins, your voice of the Thunderbirds, and women's basketball coach Amber Rowe Mosley. Uh, coach Rowe, thanks for joining me once again. You've been very patient with me all season long, and here we go with another uh, series of questions. Okay. Now folks, I wanted to say this right to you off the top. Tonight's win was fantastic for the T-Birds. 91 to 55 is your final score, and the Thunderbirds led by a margin of 40 at one point in the second half. So a very solid win for Highline tonight. Uh, Coach, congratulations, first of all. Uh, tell me about how this win makes a statement for you in the league as we, again, as I asked you before with the Pierce game, how does this really solidify your spot in the league moving toward NWACs? Well, there's been no doubt in my mind that we're one of the top four teams. Um, we played absolutely horrible down at Grace Harbor in a loss, um, and I think the girls had something to prove tonight, um, and they definitely needed to prove something tonight. But it, I just we're kind of starting to get a little bit of consistency going, and that's really mm -hmm. what we're looking for is that we just keep building on the things that we've been working on. To get 91 points on a team that struggled offensively is, is a big relief and, and very exciting. Excellent. Uh, someone who played very excitingly tonight was one of your bigger girls, number 52, Kamika Nolan. Mm -hmm. uh, she's got uh, some height, especially when she gets her hands in the air, and she blocked a three-point attempt in a very, very sound <laughs> fashion. Yes. We'll put it uh, in a politically correct way. Yeah. But Kamika seems to have not only the ability to make big plays, but she's got a big personality overall. So just give me an idea of what she brings to the team in terms of chemistry. Kamika is a worker. Um, she's super athletic, um, and she's just a workhorse, and the girls feed off of that. If there's a board out there to be got, she's going to get it, right. um, especially when we need it. Um, and, and she runs the court. She's our defensive stopper, I think, especially down in the post. We'll put her on their best players even when she's undersized because she does have those long arms and is able to block shots. And, you know, that block tonight was something that spurred us on. We were already up big, but it kind of gave us that little bit of extra oomph that we needed to finish off the game. Mm -hmm. Now, finishing off the game is something that, of course, you did. Uh, you had the lead for essentially the game. I believe it was wire to wire. Now, when you're up by 40 points in the second half, and it becomes apparent to everyone in the building that you're going to win by a large margin, mm -hmm. how do you as a coach keep the girls focused and on task? Um, I didn't have to do much in the second half. We talked about it at halftime and said, you know, we have to come out aggressive. We were up big against Tacoma early, and then second half, not so good. So they knew they had to build on that. But to be able to win by almost 40 and play all 12 players a lot of minutes, mm -hmm. that's very decisive. Yeah. That's not like playing just six, you know, your, your top six. So right. very pleased with that. Well, I'm glad everyone could get into the game tonight. Yeah. It, was, it was exciting and just fun to watch uh, a Thank big you. victory for the T-Birds. All right, guys, it's going to be South Puget Sound coming up next. Again, this is Cooper Hopkins with Coach Amber Rowe Mosley. Thanks for tuning in. Thank